Welcome back to Mash Tips. There are several years of hard work to build up a YouTube channel. And you can imagine that you lose that YouTube account in one night like this. It's not a pleasant news anyway. There are certain things that you can do in advance before you lose your channel. Let us see a few of those tips that's gonna help you to protect your YouTube account from hackers. Think about a hacker when he try to get access to your YouTube account. First of all, he want to get an email ID attached with your YouTube account. Usually they can check your YouTube about tab and get the email ID that provider there. Or they can check your YouTube video description and if you have provided any business communication email that might be associated with your YouTube account. So that might be the first target point when they try to attack you. They wanna get your email ID associated with your YouTube account. What do we recommend here? Always use a dedicated email ID just for your YouTube account. Do not publish your YouTube account email ID anywhere. Somehow the hacker got your email ID and now he want to get a password to access your account. So first of all, he will try some simple passwords like names related to your name, your date of birth or your location name. Or I have seen sometimes the users are using very simple password, easy to guess for their email account. And second thing, as you know, you hear about a lot of hacking stories. It's good to change your password occasionally. Make sure that you are using a unique password when you change your password every time. If you don't have any choice to keep those complicated passwords, there are dedicated password managers. Those can keep your passwords or those can create unique passwords for your different accounts. In addition to that, you can check whether your password is compromised previously. Google Chrome has an inbuilt tool to check whether your password is compromised or there is an another tool called Have I Been Pawned. Those tools are free and you can depend on those tools to check and make sure your password never compromised before. What I'll take here, always use a unique, complicated password with special characters for your YouTube account. And do not use the same password for any other accounts. Hope you are enjoying this video and if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for latest updates. So we are in a third stage now. Somehow the hacker got access to your email ID and he got the password. Still, there is an additional step that you can use to secure your YouTube account and that's called two-factor authentication. The two-factor authentication is a free additional layer of security on top of this password to secure your account. Always enable this two-factor authentication for your online accounts. There are several types of two-factor authentication solutions widely used in industry. The first one is an SMS two-factor authentication. So you know the OTP method while you try to get into a YouTube account, you will get an, a temporary password to log into that YouTube account. The SMS are not 100% secure but there are more secured options to use the two-factor authentication. One of them is to use the third-party apps like Google is offering Google Authenticator or OD. Those are providing a certain code for a certain time to use as a two-factor authentication. So these codes are temporary, so the hacker cannot guess those codes and access your account. Similarly, Google is offering an additional technology for this two-factor authentication. You may notice that after you enable two-factor authentication, you will get a pop-up on your Android phone with a code. If you are using an iPhone and if you already installed a Google or Gmail app on your iPhone, you can get the same two-factor authentication solution through these apps from Google. So those are the second level of two-factor authentication solutions. If you want more secure two-factor authentication solutions, you can go for hardware keys. Google is offering Titan security key. It's a hardware device that you have to insert into your PC to authorize the account access. What I'll take here, enable two-factor authentication for all your accounts, including the account that associated with your YouTube. And instead of depending on SMS two-factor authentication, go for these two-factor apps or the Google solution for two-factor authentication. 
So the next option for the hacker is to get a compromised devices or apps. Those are associated with your email ID. They can inject a malware into that app or the devices and they can record the keystrokes or your activity to get an access to your account. So always I would recommend to keep your YouTube email ID secure and do not use that email ID to join multiple devices. If you already use that email ID on multiple devices, there is an option to sign out of all devices that's attached with this YouTube email ID. You can see the screenshot here and you can go to this link and sign out from all devices that associated with your YouTube email ID. So what I'll take here, always keep an eye on the devices and apps that you are logged in with your YouTube ID. Do not use your YouTube email ID on multiple devices. Okay, now you have two-factor authentication enabled and you have a secured password. Now, from the hacker standpoint, use a phishing email attack with a link or inject some malware into your browser and he can get access to your system. Similarly, if you are getting a lot of emails with links, you may see a hyperlink over there, might be a short link redirecting to a malware site. So do not click any unknown or suspicious link on the email. Your account may be compromised while you browse on a certain websites. Be careful when you visit any suspicious website. It is always good to have a dedicated device for your YouTube account. Always log in with that device for your YouTube account. And if you are using a Chrome, do not use a lot of plugins or extensions while you are browsing on your YouTube account. Those extensions or plugins may have some malwares and do not try to install those on your Chrome profile. When you open the emails, don't click on the suspicious links or short links attached into that emails. It is good idea to always log out after you check your YouTube account or the emails associated with that YouTube account. If you are using a dedicated Android phone, be made sure when you install any APK files or apps from an unknown source because these APK files or apps from unknown source may have some codes that may compromise your account or inject some malware into your phone and they can get access to your YouTube account. So do not install any unknown apps or APK files on your dedicated device for your YouTube. What I'll take here, always use a dedicated Chrome profile with a limited extensions for your YouTube account. And do not open any suspicious emails or click on any suspicious links. Most important, be selective while you select your channel admins or channel managers for you. Do not give the access to any suspicious account and make sure all other managers or creators or whoever have access to your YouTube account, they enabled this two-factor authentication and followed all the steps that we listed here. Always keep a backup of all your YouTube videos in an external hard disk. Google has a separate tool to prevent phishing with a password alert and whenever log in with your password, you can get an alert. It's a dedicated tool for the Chrome browser. If you are using a Wi-Fi at your home, make sure you are using a secure Wi-Fi router for your home network and you protected both admin and Wi-Fi SSID password with a unique complicated password. I'll take here Install a password alert extension on your Google Chrome and do not give access to any suspicious account on it to your YouTube account. Okay, so everything is good from our part and somehow if you are very unlucky, your YouTube account may access by a hacker. What do you can do if somebody hacks your YouTube account? The first step, whenever the hacker try to access your account, he will try to change the password of your YouTube account. So if you know the notification, I would recommend act immediately. Go to your account and immediately change your password to a different unique password. Most of the time, the hacker will be quicker than you and he may already change the account password. In that case, try to click on the forgot password on your Google account and try to recover the password. That's an additional trap that you can try to recover your lost account. 
just in case if you couldn't get that forgot password option or if you fail to recover back your account still there are some other solutions that you can try if your channel is monetized or if you have a second channel that's already monetized you can contact youtube support and try to get access back and try to resolve this issue so there is an option to access this form if you have a monetized channel and you can contact the youtube support team to recover back your channel whether it is a primary or secondary source of income for you or your family you have to take all security measures to secure your channel do your best and invest some time to go through all the steps described here to secure your youtube account and other online accounts always keep an eye on your online accounts and enable password alert on Google Chrome to get an immediate notification if somebody try to hack your account. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for latest updates. Thank you for watching this video and we will see you on another one.